So in order to restore an area, you need some native plants. And Robin's brought you into the nursery here. Robin, where do you get the plants from in the first place? Okay, the plants come from seeds. <laughs> <laughs> some of them here. Um, if it's at all possible, we like to pull seeds off uh, at the right time in the year. They're all different for different plants. And uh, so we're allowed to eco-source seed from Paikokariki to Peka Peka. So that's where we start. Right, so really important to get that local seed so it's adapted mm. to the area and you're restoring it back to its natural straight yep. state rather than introducing other plants. Mm. So talk us through what we can see here behind okay. us. All right, okay, so we're in the first stage of the uh, nursery here and uh, we're raising tiny seedlings. So you can see in front of you uh, here, um, some just uh, c coming up and uh, they all vary how long that they're going to take and of course depends on the climatic conditions. So we don't raise anything under a, a glass house. Everything is raised in the open air. Um, it's protected from, from wind etc. So over here we've got some kind of prosma repens I see grow growing and that's going to be um, yeah probably three or four more, more months I think before it reaches the brick out stage. Yeah, it's pretty tiny mm. and further down we've got uh, larger seedlings but they have to be repotted? Yes, yep. So basically at, e at each stage as they start to bulk up a bit uh, they need to come out of the, the trays into an individual pot uh, over here to give them uh, yeah, the chance to expand and, and grow. Yep. And you may have seen the Waikanae school students potting up plants. Mm. What was special about what uh, they use to pot them with? Okay, so we use a compost mix but we also use old sand. So we have a bank over there outside and this is only something we've been doing for about 18 months. Um, it's a bit experimental but we found it's better for the hardening off process if they're already slightly conditioned to the sand. So right. we walked around, found a, a deep bank and we're like a bigger rabbit, we're burrowing a hole in the bank to get old sand to mix with the potting compost, generally around about 50-50 mix. Excellent. So once, once you've got the plants to a reasonable size, yep. you can plant them out and that's what you're going to help with next.